We have a vision to help equip the Black Country Church to deal with the needs of vulnerable families by linking individuals in your churches with the experts ready to help them serve local families in need. In doing so, we believe we can see hundreds of families impacted and lives changed across our region. Love Black Country Families is an initial collaboration of three national charities who each work with families in different but complementary ways. Home for Good work to raise awareness of the need for foster and adoptive parents. They encourage families to provide loving homes for children in care and equip the church to offer welcoming communities for fostered and adopted children. Safe families for children accept referrals from partnering local authorities to match struggling families with caring volunteers in their area who can provide tailored help and wraparound care. This can hopefully prevent the need for children to go into care by providing early intervention to families until they get back on their feet. YMCA Open Door offer vulnerable young people short-term accommodation in a spare room in the homes of individuals, couples and families who live in the black country. Over the last 18 months, we've worked hard to network between these charities and help them see how complementary they are to each other. And for the first time nationally, these charities have agreed to work together on this Families Champions initiative. Their partnership is truly groundbreaking. And this is why they've agreed to do it. God has given people in your congregation the gifts, abilities and provision needed to contribute to a solution to the same problem all of these charities are trying to tackle. However, the problem comes when trying to make the average church member aware of the potential there is to help local children, young people and families in need. They often just don't know how they can help or the various levels at which they can help. Not everyone will be called to foster or adopt, but that doesn't mean they can't offer a spare room and a warm breakfast to a vulnerable young person for a weekend every now and then, or take the children of a struggling family out for the day to give the parents some respite. There will be people in your church who could do those things. They just don't realise that there are charities that can help them do it. Additionally, church leaders are already incredibly busy. And when new organisations like these ones want to partner with their church, it can often be outside their capacity to engage with them, let alone get their church members to do the same. The solution, we hope, could be this. Our vision is for each church in this area to have a families champion who helps to raise awareness of families in need and then connect people in your church with the charity's best place to help them support children, young people and needy families in our area. The Families Champion will need to do four very practical things. Firstly, attend. Attend an annual training evening run by Love Black Country Families to help them understand the work of each of our partner charities and how people can get involved with them. Two, read. Read a monthly newsletter written by Love Black Country Families that will help keep them up to date with the latest activities of our partner charities. Thirdly, promote. Promote the vision for families and share about the ways that people in your church can support local families in a 10 minute slot, once a quarter, in the church's main gatherings. Make sure families are on the church's prayer agenda and that key dates are put in the church calendar, such as Adoption Sunday and Homeless Sunday. Finally, connect. Connect people in your church that show an interest in supporting local children, young people and families with the relevant partner charity that can help them do it. In this respect, they'll act as a broker between the church members and the charities. The church leader needs to nominate their family's champion. This person should be someone with a heart for families and children, but it doesn't have to be the youth or children's worker. Try to think outside the box. Whoever you choose, these are the next steps that you need to take if this is something you want your church to be involved with. Firstly, choose a champion. Share the vision with them and make sure they want to do it. Secondly, send us their details. We need your champion's name and email address. Please send it to families at loveblackcountry.org.uk. Then thirdly, we will contact them 
and they'll be invited to a training evening on Monday the 19th of September 2016. Finally, launch Love Black Country Families. Plan your church calendar to allow space on Adoption Sunday the 6th of November for your family's champion to have their first 10 minute slot to launch the vision. We will provide them with all the resources they need to do this. Further information can be found online at www.loveblackcountry.org. Alternatively, you can email families at loveblackcountry.org.uk.